Meanwhile, APOP has released a statement reacting to the arrest and death of one of theirs. We caught up with the spokesperson of the group, Emma Powerful. And here is the telephone interview with him. What can you tell us about what happened yesterday? The arrest and the death of a, mem uh, of a leader of IPOP. They, they lied to the public that they, they, they approached, they enter our camp. Nigerian army can never in their life enter ESN camp. That is a promise. They just, the guy went to his village. They ambushed him there. That was all. Why did you say they can never enter your camp? They cannot because they don't have the will there to enter there. They don't have the power. Do you, you I, do you mean that you have the firepower? God is on our side and God is protecting us. So what happened? How did you lose the member and uh, how many of your people have been arrested? They have arrested more than, since uh, in Imo State, they, 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 they arrested more than 50 people in Izonde, in uh, Uguta, or Haji, Ewema, LUGA. They have been arresting people, going to their houses and they arrest them. In Anambra, they arrested so many people. In Abia, they arrested so many people. And uh, yesterday on, the guy, the, our commander went to his village, he's from our mama. They ambushed him with his, some politicians, Opus Orema, Obioso, and the coup. They ambushed him, ordered the, um, the military to kill him. That was what happened. You send a, a tacit threat to the governor of uh, Imo State. What he do you mean by that threat? A lot of, he knows Imo State, gov Imo State administrator. The Supreme Court administrator knows very well that he committed a crime and we must follow him up. What crime did he commit? He ordered for the killing of this guy because he refused his offer. What offer is that? To come and, to come and hear the uh, embargo which the Southeast governors uh, established. When did he offer him? Did he speak to him on the phone? Did he have a meeting he with said, him? He sent some people to meet him. And what happened? He refused or what? what, what the, guy, the guy refused that he cannot betray Biafra's agitation and the ES and our leader, Mazen and the colonel. Since then, they have been threatening him. And so, um, when you now send this threat, what, are, what do you plan to do? You don't, you don't ask me what I my plans we have plans and we must, we must uh, uh, execute it that's all i'm very sure you are aware that the federal government has prescribed your organization so why are they running from their courts to come and defend it that is a black market prescription you are not worried that you are described as terrorists we are not terrorists you know that no, that's what you the federal government you calls you. You know that IPOB is not a, a, a terrorist. But that's what the federal government calls you. They, they call because they don't want to defend it. They, want, they don't want us to defend the matter in the court. Every day, any court date, they run away. Don't you know that? So what are you, what are you planning to do now? We are planning to get Biafra. When are you planning to do that? God knows the time. Okay, so let me, because residents of Omuma, when we interviewed them yesterday, they said that the people that attacked the governor's house are members of ESN. What do you, what do you have to say to that? Anybody can say whatever he or she likes. It doesn't concern us. So, and that's the reason why I asked the question in the first place that are your members or ESN, are they the ones who attacked the governor's house? Because those who saw it said your members were the ones who staged that attack. For some of the information that we have when we went on the ground and the pictures that we saw of the late uh, Ikonso commander that was killed yesterday by security operatives, they said they recovered several sophisticated weapons, including six AK-47 rifles, hundreds of ammunition of different calibers, and lots of charms, including bulletproof charms. How true is this? Can you, first of, first of all, ESN don't use, we don't use army uniform. 
Nigerian Army uniform. That is number one. Number two, they presented three AK-47 with one magazine. How can somebody use three AK magazine, AK-47 with one magazine? They presented 10, 10, 10 bullets. Why we have no uh, machine gun there? So these things, they are, they are liars. All those informations are false. They are not saying the truth because they don't want to tell the Nigerians, the citizens, the, the, the citizens that Nigeria is almost collapsing. And the IPOB have decided that nothing will stop them to back out on this course for their fire restoration. So other uh, tribes can work for their own. They can say whatever they like. We are intact. IPOB and the ESN, we are intact. So, Another commander has taken over. What is the name of the commander? I will tell you. If you say that uh, your intentions is for the Igbo nation. Um, we are not I, talking of, my, for, first of all, mind you, we are not talking of Igbo nation, we are talking of Biafra. Biafra comprises so many tribes, not only Igbo nation. We are not talking of Igbo nation, we are talking of Biafra. So what are your thoughts former about... Former Eastern region, former Eastern region, both South, South and South East. We are not talking of Igbo nation. But let me okay. ask you, uh, what are your thoughts on the establishment of Ebubeago? Ebubeago has, it's a ghost to security outfit. So we have nothing to do with them. <laughs> the, if, if there is no group called Ebubeago, that one is, that name is from out. It's a, it's a ghost group. We have not seen them. Let them come out and do the funny things. We should know where they belong. Okay, so confirm to us, ESN is not behind the attack on the governor's house. I told you before, when you went to Abuma and interviewed people, did they tell you that those that came to attack in that very place mentioned ESN, and we are ESN, we are IPOB? You yes. Answer me up till now. They said so, yes. The people said they are ESN. Commun they are, members of the communities. Uh, Yes, they said. Yes, yes, that's what they told us. Yes, that's what they told us. Yes, they lied to you. They lied to you. They told us that, that, that that's what they confided in us that they are members of ESN. They are lying. So you are saying that ESN, ESN, ESN does not have a hand in it. ESN can never come on operation and tell you we are ESN. We can't do that. We know we know what we are doing. Okay. So what kind of operation does ESN do? We pursue flanning terrorists in our bushes and our forests.